All right, guys, I just want to talk really quick about intra workout nutrition or my thought process on the word intra workout nutrition. I really like to get the nutrients in, and, and all these things, these are basically all nutrient drivers nutrient drivers, nutrient support, um, muscle protein breakdown support, muscle protein synthesis support. So, within all these ingredients, specific things that we're using for training, what I really like to do is I like to get them in before training simply because your body only has so much energy to a lot to doing one thing one task at a time so if you start to put all this in during training your body's fighting then what you're doing through the training stimulus and then also trying to digest this so i like to get the digestion process started early so that way you can actually utilize these nutrients during training rather than just having them sit in your stomach so all these individual ingredients are all going to serve and aid not only in nutrient delivery during training but also aid in the recovery process get that recovery process started early so you just don't really want all that sitting in your stomach during the training session itself so what i like to do is i like to get all of my ingredients and, I, and i'm not going to talk specifically about what i take because that doesn't really matter that's really more individual based um, but i like to get all these ingredients in about 20 to 30 minutes before i actually start training so that, that way they can be utilized during the training session and then something that's also very very important is your hydration levels not only going into training but the amount of fluid that you're putting for these agents to be mixed with okay so when you're talking about cyclic dextrin carbohydrate it's a high molecular weight carbohydrate, so you need a lot of fluids for that to pass through your digestive tract, all right? So what I would not recommend to you guys is to put like 50 grams of carbs in 20 ounces of water. The more water you can get to help that assimilate and go through your system, the better, all right? So today, what I'm gonna be using is 50 grams of carbs. Um, I like to get about five grams of leucine, and then also in terms of pump products, again, you want the pump products to help process and push the pump during your actual training so it's important to get them in before rather than drinking them during and then something else for you guys just to think about really quick if you choose to drink this stuff during and you're training for 90 minutes and you're sipping every three to five minutes you're really not getting the impact of those ingredients during your training session all right so whatever ingredients you're taking i really recommend that you get them in prior to to actually further aid your training rather than just getting hydration in during your training